For the past nine years, Shelly has ruled the mansion. Hi, Ab. Hi, girls. Hi, Hi. Shelly. Looking good. But today, she's about to get a wake-up call. They're kicking me out? Maybe it's because of your age. But I'm 27. But that's 59 in bunny years. I don't have anything. I don't know what to do. You need a yap. A yap. Yeah. This summer, it looks like a bunch of little Playboy mansions. She's looking for a place to call home. Do you ladies go to school here too? We're the house mothers of the sororities. This would be perfect for me. This is not a brothel. Oh, I'm not looking to make soup. Try Zeta. Their last house mother was hospitalized with hallucinations. Awesome. Now. Hello? Sometimes when you need help... How can we be so smart, but everyone kind of thinks we're losers? Reading, earthling... <laughs> the person you least expect... My name is Shelly, and I'm here to be your house mother. ...will be exactly what you need. We have to be popular. Guys like her. And since guys don't like us, I figured Shelly here could teach us how. I am just so happy that you guys want me here. This is Harmony. Harmony. And then Joanne. Joanne. What is that? It's just this thing I do to remember people's names. Natalie. You hired the exorcist. That's great. From Happy Madison, who brought you 50 first dates. Shelly, that's Colby. I'm in love with him. That's so sweet. How long have you guys been going out? I've never even talked to him. By the time I'm done, every girl on campus will want to pledge Zeta. Listen. He's changing their style. That's it, lady. Now we can be the best versions of ourselves. You're pretty pleased with yourself, aren't you? I am a little proud. Don't mess with me. <sighs> and they're giving her the education of a lifetime. So I met this boy named Oliver. He didn't fall for any of my tricks. I think I dropped some money over here. Maybe it's over here by this manhole. Ah! That is freaking hot! Anna Ferris is the house bunny. What if Oliver doesn't mind a smart girl? <laughs> Have you given any thought to who you might be voting for? I definitely won't listen to what Simon says. He is just so mean. I usually always agree with Paula and Randy. Oh, you meant the president. Hey, everybody. I'm Brian Corsetti. And I'm Chelsea Cannell. And you're watching TrailerHits.com. Now, that was a very interesting trailer we just saw. Oh, I think you liked it. Ah, uh, of course. You put hot chicks, college, you know, booze. I mean, you, you can't go wrong. I think, I'm really shocked, actually, Brian. I would have thought this was chick flick all the way, and yeah. I would have expected you to be like, eh. But I'm actually pretty impressed. You know what, but it's okay, it's chick flick. You know, you bring you can bring people to it. But I think the reason why it's a guy's movie is, what's her name? Heidi, Anna Ferris. An Anna Ferris. she's great, it looks like. And you know what is so cool about this? The casting. Because yes. Anna Ferris would not have been probably my first choice for this kind of a role. You've got a Jessica Simpson, there's tons of blondes out there right. that are trying to act. But, but she pulled it I off. I mean, even a Paris Hilton, you could see mm, this movie with Paris Hilton. Paris yeah, Hilton? But it wouldn't, but it, yeah. she could play this role. Right. But it wouldn't do, I mean, this is, Perfect casting, but yeah. wouldn't I had I been the casting director? I don't know if I would have thought of Anna Ferris, and I think it's just superb. Couldn't she get knocked any it out of the park. She looks fantastic. Yeah, oh, stunning. And you know what else is cool about this movie? It's also got Catherine McPhee and Rumor Willis. Right, and this, so the cast is pretty crazy. Uh, and uh, I can't forget Hugh Hefner and the girls next door. Yeah, Hugh, what's the deal with that guy? Again, <laughs> he's back in the saddle again. Does he ever get flaccid? I mean, this guy is the <laughs> pimp of our generation, last generation, and generations Ten to generations. come. Ten generations, I know. You know what's what's going to happen? Like, who's going to fill his shoes? Can you fill his shoes? I don't, I don't even know. I don't think he could fill Hugh's shoes. I I don't think so either. But how old is Larry he? Flint might have tried, but he tried, but he did. went crazy. Now you know what's really cool about this to me though is the plot. Like, why hasn't someone thought about this before? Now I know there was Van Wilder, and it's right. kind of similar to that. But the fact that a Playboy bunny could get too old and actually be kicked out of the house by Hef. Genius. Hysterical. But it happens. So funny. It happens. It has to happen, It, right? it has to happen. Because he mean, went from like 10 girlfriends to three, so <laughs> someone had to get the cut, right? Right. Somebody, exactly. <laughs> like, what do you do when you're Hef's girlfriend and then you just get cut? So uh, this movie is maybe based on some truth. I think it is definitely based on some truth. And it's it's hysterical. I mean. You know what? You know what else I thought? I didn't mean to interrupt, but it's it has somewhat of a clueless 
vibe when totally. she goes in and they try to fix up the sorority and stuff. She's That's got cool. an Alicia Silverstone feel to her uh -huh. too, which is great because I think after Clueless, everybody wanted to see more of these movies out of Alicia, and it just wasn't what she wanted to do. Right. So brilliant movie, and I wanted to tell you this is something that I found really cool and definitely sealed the deal for me. Happy Madison Productions. That's yeah. All right. Great. Great. And brilliant. He's brilliant. He's a brilliant man. Yeah. I mean, you just you cannot pick a better script. So three things that I like, and then I'm going to ask you your three things. The 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 situation with the the, the Playboy situation. <laughs> you just want to say girls. I just just say chicks. I just, chicks. I just want to see chicks. I just want to see chicks. So hit or miss. I am going to go with hit for sure. I agree. Hit. Double hit and girls I'm night see out the movie. with Brian. Yes. <laughs> I love that. <laughs> yeah, it is a hit all the way. Definitely will be seeing this movie. Well, guys, that's it we've got for you today. I'm Brian Corsetti. And I'm Chelsea Cannell. And you're watching TrailerHits.com.